Hi and welcome to our flying adventures. It's all about the journey. Today I just wanted to respond to a lot of the questions I had about camera mounting equipment and the different video cameras that I use. So we're going to set it up uh, with four out of the five cameras. Top left is a front view from the windscreen looking forward. Top right of course is the crew cam with my homely face. Bottom left is the camera that I usually shoot with but I'm going to try and zoom it in and focus on the panel during my flights. Bottom right is the left wing camera view and I did not set up uh, the right wing because I left the mounting bracket out in the truck and I didn't feel like getting out and getting back in and hey look at that puppy dog out there wandering around. Yes Ziva was with me at the airport. Okay, we'll start at the um, top left. The front view is a VIRB camera, and it has a RAM suction mount uh, for the mounting. I do not have a audio cable for the ATC comms off this. This just picks up in cockpit, uh, mainly engine noise. Sometimes you can hear me talk on that when I'm at real low idle. Next is the top right hand view and that is the crew cam which is a Hero, or I'm sorry, a GoPro Hero 4 black and it's a simple mounting with double sided tape just holds it in place. I like the angle it shoots. Uh, basic, simple, quick and easy, easy to change batteries or I can plug in uh, to a power supply if needed. Okay next on the bottom left is the uh, front or panel view with a Garmin VIRBXE. This is mounted as you can see in the top right view with a track form bracket as pictured there on the bottom right. And this thing is very adjustable, works really well. It attaches with the four Allen screws and I attach it around the uh, inner headset post. You'll have to excuse the view on the bottom left. It's uh, the bright sun coming in through the windscreen, which uh, makes it a little bit dark looking at that view inside the hangar today. Next up on the bottom right is the wing view, either left or right side, or at times both. For this, I use the Activon Gold camera. Cheap camera, does a good job, and it's mounted with a ram mount suction cup does a good job, holds them in place, provides easy access for battery change or again to hook up to a power bank. I would also like to add the tail tie down setup that I use and that is an active on gold camera in the hard mounted case pictured there at the bottom uh, left and I use the My Pilot Pro mounting bracket for the tail tie down hook. Works great. Here's some footage I shot with the camera great views and uh, the battery life leaves something to be desired but we'll have to work on that. I guess doing uh, this review wouldn't be complete without mentioning the power banks that I have talked about throughout the uh, presentation. On the left is an EC technology portable charger or power bank 22,400 milliamp hours it has three USB ports available and it has a flashlight. It works fantastic with my iPhone, iPad, and all my video cameras. Uh, pictured on the right is the lipstick power bank. That's what it's referred to. It's made by Anchor. Uh, it's 5,000 uh, milliamp hours. It has one USB port. It works great with the iPhone, the iPad, and my video cameras. It just doesn't have the long life. I'm considering purchasing another EC technology uh, triple USB port to uh, to keep on hand in the plane. Even once you're out, you want to charge your phone at lunch or wherever you're at. These are very affordable and uh, they work fantastic for getting the job done. All right, thanks for uh, watching today. I hope I answered some of your questions. If you have anything else, uh, please leave me a comment and I'll try and answer it as quickly as I can. Thanks and take care. Don't forget, subscribe and like. and. Um, we should have a mission coming up to uh, Mississippi shortly in the next few weeks, so look for that flight video coming out. Thanks again.